Mtazamaji shule zikitarajiwa kufunguliwa mwezi ujao idara ya afya katika kaunti ya Busia imeamuru maafisa wa afya ya umma kuhakikisha kwamba shule zote katika kaunti hiyo zinatimiza masharti ya afya kabla ya shule kufunguliwa. Maafisa hao wametakiwa kufanya ukaguzi shuleni kuhakikisha taratibu za kuzuia maambukizi miongoni mwa wanafunzi zimezingatiwa. Robert Malala anaarifu kutoka kaunti hiyo ya Busia. Afisa mkuu wa afya ya umma katika idara ya afya kaunti ya Busia Jonathan Ino amesema kwa kama moja wapo njia za kuafikia malengo ya serikali kuruhusu shughuli za masomo kurejelea ni sharti idara hiyo kukagua mazingira ya shule zote kabla ya kufunguliwa ili kuzuia maambukizi I'm seeing the minutes of health has already ordered that teachers are supposed to report back to their workstation as the government as the county government of Busia we are going to uh, direct our public health officers to do thorough inspection in all schools within the county to ensure that they meet the minimum basic standards to to be used as a classroom or as a learning institution similarly we're also going to do fumigation in all those schools and uh, we'll get in touch with our counterparts from the department of education the county director of education to see how we can be able to do this one seamlessly so that uh, we beat the deadline when the government now will officially announce the schools to be operational akiongea mjini busia wakati wa fla kupokea bidhaa za msaada wa kusaidia kina mama mashinani kujikinga na maambukizi ya corona kutoka kwa shirika la ampath chini ya mradi wa chama cha mama toto afisa huyo amewahimiza wenyeji wa kaunti ya busia kuendelea kutilia manani hofu ya maambukizi ya virusi vya corona na kufuata maagizo ipasavyo but uh, so far so good we are seeing somehow uh, the curve is coming down but it's not a point for us to celebrate and that one has made the uh, people to relax on some of these core measures that the minister of health has given we are appealing to the people of busia and general kenya that please let us ensure that we observe the core preventive measures that the minister of health has laid down that is hand washing which is very key because uh, research has confirmed that uh, proper hand washing you will be able to do away with over 70% of different kind of microorganisms which can cause disease or pathogens which can cause disease over 70% if we do it we are also talking about social distancing which is very key that let us maintain social distancing wakati huo huo afisa huyo amepongeza shirika hilo kutokana na ufadhili huo kwa kila mekitaja kama hatua itakayosaidia serikali ya kaunti kudhibiti maambukizi ya corona. Ampat has brought us over 4000 uh, masks which is targeted to take care of the of the uh, of the chama cha mama toto within three sub counties within uh, Busia county. Uh, similarly they have also brought us hand washing uh, containers and the liquid soap. All this is towards ensuring that uh, the prevention measures on covid-19 is well taken care of hata hivyo maafisa wa mradi wa chama cha mama toto akiongozwa na meneja Justice Ikemer pamoja na mshirikisho wa mipango wa mradi huo bi Angela Juma wameelezea kuhofia swala la kina mama wajawazito wanaojifungua na wale wanaolea watoto kukosa kutafuta huduma katika vituo vya afya najua wakati huu wa covid kumekuwa na shida kidogo kwa sababu wa mama pia wanaogopa kwenda hospitali wanafikiria kuwa kuna covid na wanaogopa kwenda hospitali. So ni wakati ambao sasa tunafikiria turudi bado kwa, kwa vijiji na tuwaambia wa mama it is safe kuenda katika hospitali ili wajifungulie huko kwa sababu tutaweza drop the ball tukisema tuna concentrate kwa covid peke yake na tuwache hizi indicators zingine. Sasa tunataka tu ku make sure kuwa that we are not dropping the ball tunaendelea kufanya na wakina mama na kuwahimiza waende kujifungua katika hospitali. Tungependa tu pia kuwahimiza kina mama kina mama wajawazito wote Busia kwenye kaunti ya Busia um, twende kwenye hospitali wakati tuko wajawazito tusijifungulie nyumbani kina mama kwa sababu tunajua zile hatari ambazo zinahusika na kujifungua nyumbani na kando na hiyo tuhakikishe kuwa tunaenda pia zile kliniki za mapema wakati mama ni mjamzito ili ikiwa una shida ama hatari yoyote ya ujauzito wale wa hudumu wa afya waweze kusaidia mapema. Naomba pia muweze kwenda kwenye kliniki za baada ya kujifungua kwa sababu huo ndio wakati ambao unapata unaangaliwa iwapo una hatari zozote za baada ya kujifungua 
na pia mtoto wako anaangaliwa aidha wamesema kwa kupitia kwa mradi huo ambao utanufaisha zaidi ya mama elfu moja mene kutoka maeneo bunge ya Matayus teso kusini na bunyala utasaidia kuhamasisha kina mama usika hasa kuhusu muhimu wa kutafuta huduma katika vituo vya afya tunapeana barakoa masks Uh, kwa kina mama ambao wanajihusisha kwenye mradi wa chama cha mama toto kuhakikisha kuwa wanaenda hospitali wakizingatia zile sheria ambazo wizara ya afya imeweka ime, ime, kuhakikisha kuna maambukizi ya, ya covid na pia tunapeana tanks kuhakikisha kuwa kina mama aweze kuosha mkono wa, ili wasipate wasi, wasi yale maambukizi ya covid kwa sasa katika busia county tuko na vikundi moja na salasini na katika hizo vikundi tuko na kina mama 1400 na pia tumemiz, tu, pia tuko na vikundi za kina baba ambazo zinaitwa chama cha baba toto ambazo tuko na vikundi kumi na wa, wanaume ambao wamejiunga na hiyo vikundi ni wanaume moja ishirini. kile ambacho ningependa kuhimiza kina mama wa Busia County ikiwa wako wajawazito ama pia wako na watoto chini ya miaka mitano waweze kujiunga katika vikundi hivi vya mama toto licha ya kuonekana ishara ya maambukizi ya virusi vya corona kudidimia lakini ni changamoto kwa wenyeji akaunti ya Busia kufuata masharti zaidi ili kukamilisha vita hivyo. Robert Malala Nyota TV kaunti ya Busia. Mbali na hayo familia moja kutoka kijiji cha Kit